Whoa, hello friends, how's it going? This is Jeff, your friend, playing the Temple of Elemental Evil Plus. Alright, uh, let's see, the, where we last left off, I sold off the stuff that I got at the moat house. So, I have a, you know, a good bit of money right now. And I think we're going to try to do a few more quests. And then we're going to have to go to Emery Road. Roads or Emery something. Oh, let me see. Oh yeah, this one. Emerity Meadows, that's what it is. This is gonna have to take out the giant, which is it's that's gonna be kinda tough. Um but I, I thought I might try to do some quests, a little bit more quests here. So let me just see if I'll go to the north for just a moment. Yes, sir. I cleared out the moat house, so I'm wondering if uh, if I can tell Turgeon. Sure. Forget any XP for that. Let's see. Welcome back to the Church of Saint Cuthbert. How can I help you? Okay. Yeah. Right here. I've cleared out the moat house. I'm afraid I won't be able to return home until a new cannon is sent here to replace me. Now I am hearing reports of dangerous guilds forming in Nolb. I fear the evil has not yet fully departed there. It should be your next destination. Okay, again, like I said, you know, you can click this and go directly to it, which is usually not advised. And it's already on our map anyway, but like I said, we had to get the XP for clearing out the moat house. I don't know how much XP we get. I didn't check, but anyways, let's see if we how can I help you? I can perform conversions here in my church, providing a willing convert who can prove worthy in the eyes of Saint Cuthbert. Good news then. Thank you for your help. Jack is a good man who has come to see the strength and goodness of Saint Cuthbert and will prosper for his conversion. How can I help you? I can perform conversions here in my church. When this church was established by Her Holiness Canon Aside, the entire community was of the old faith. We are always looking for more converts to St. Cuthbert. Hmm. Well, uh, let me see if he... How can I help? Alright, so he's not going to give me any more then, I guess. You know, I do have money, um, so let me... Let me go back downstairs. I'm off. Welcome back to the Church of St. Cuthbert. How can I be of service, miss? Remember, St. Cuthbert rewards those who give freely to the needy. Yes. Very well. Let me look. Okay, there we go. Okay, so... Now I do have like 500 platinum uh, from selling off all that stuff. Things like that, so... So I'm thinking that maybe I should buy some potions. Oh, there's only one moderate, so... are all light. I mean, yeah, I don't know. I still have 400, so that's okay. Yeah, we just get a few there that way. We have some. 
Okay. I mean, that's why you want to kind of grab all the stuff you can, because, you know, you can make money with it. <laughs> but anyways, let's see, I don't know, um, we can do some more of these quests. Oh, I know, we're going to do the... I don't know if I can do these quite yet. Um, let me come down here. I think I need to go to... So now that we're up a couple of levels, uh, let me see, we're up, uh, I can't wait, wait till they get over here. Oh yeah, we're up two levels, so we're at level three. Let's go in. Yes, sir. See if we can get the dialogue. All right, let's see. I am here to discuss the donations of flour to the church. Oh, and I still got to do this one yet, I think. Okay, let's do this first. Let's see what he says. Okay, so now let's see what's gonna work. If I say Clement, then he's going to get angry. And if I say this one, but this one, she only wants three sacks per week, so that's not asking for too much. Alright, let's see. I remember the old face. I don't know if this is the right thing to do, but I like the priest and I don't want to upset them. Okay, good. Okay, so what if I talk to the Jew? Okay, good. All right, so, all right, so there we go now. Instead of mixing some of the quests, let's go ahead and we'll just do. get this one done. That's how far is it? Now let's go ahead and go to... This might be faster, let's see. Let's go race to there. Yeah, like I said, if like we knock out a few of them, then, you know, it's a little bit better. Get a little bit of XP. It's not much that you earn in, at this town, but it's just nice to have of some of the stuff complete. Alright, let's talk with her. Hello again. Oh, no. Hmm, no, I don't know if I... Which dialogue do I use? How can I help you, my daughter? Oh, yeah, okay. I'm trying to... How kind of you, my daughter. What is the miller's problem? Okay, well, he wants to donate flour to the church. I see. And does he lack the grain? No, he's worried that you won't think... Okay, so that's... I see. That is quite the dilemma. Yes, it is. He has plenty of grain, you say? Uh, yeah, I believe he does. So, yes, give him some too. What a marvelous idea, my daughter. Please, tell the miller he may donate to both parties. With my <laughs> blessing. All right, there we go. Got it. As you wish. Yeah, I wish we could just go, like, pick something here and go to it. Can't <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, kind of sucks. All right, so I'm just gonna have to run to here, I guess. Yeah, so this will get the grain to the church quest done for us. And matter of fact, before I go in, I should look and see. It's probably, like I said, uh, you know, I don't know the exact XP that we get. It's not gonna be much compared to doing a big battle, but. Anyways, 
at the end of the game, I just know at the end of the game if you do a lot of the quests, you know, I, I don't know if you get credit for it, but, uh, or something, but anyways, let me take a look at my main character here. Alright, so we have 5,063 uh, XP. Yes, sir. Oh, and what I did uh, when I sold off all that stuff in the moat house, I gave Elmo uh, chain gloves and chain uh, boots and chain uh, cap or whatever. Just makes him look a little bit better. All right, so let's go ahead and see if we can get this done. Jaro say okay. what I have to donate to both of them now what kind of deal is this well you are all faith Mitchell balance yeah. ah all right I guess that's fair yes it is <laughs> okay great we got that done We gained a little bit of XP, but not much. But hey, it's a it's a done deal now, right? Brain for the church done. Okay. So these are all the ones that have done so far. Um, we still have we still have to go to Emer Emity Meadow, Emirati Meadows. I always say that wrong, but anyways, we still gotta go there. That, that's gonna fight the giant. That's gonna be a tough battle. Now the soul. Let me see. Oh yeah, so I'm already at the Millers. So why don't I, why don't I work, work on that? All right. So let me see. Now I. I don't know if I should talk to him or him. Let me see. Okay, can I talk to you about... Alright. Speak up, madam. Who wants to convert? Alright, now. Um, I will hear nothing of it. What would people say if the town miller lets members of my own household turn away from... I think they would say balance. Okay, oh yeah, so we're gonna try to throw this at him. Let's see. You sound just like Jaro. I will take that as a compliment. And like Jaro, I will not think any less of you because a servant converts. Okay, yeah, let me do that one. Um, all right, all right. Toe. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Let me see. Erlith, Erlith, whatever. Um, he can convert to Saint Cole. Okay, thanks. All right, so I can go now talk to him. All right. All right. So I think that worked. Let me see. Another soul, yeah, okay, so I'm wondering if I can now right away go to the church. And let him know that okay. that that guy converted. Okay. Of course. So I remember when I do this a long time ago, he's kind of stingy with it. Like, he gets two and Jaro gets one. And that's the way, the only way to trade it off. So he's kind of stingy about it. So he gains an extra one and Jaro, um, you know, loses whatever. But anyways, so let's get her. Welcome back to the church. How can I help you? 
I can perform conversions here in my church, providing a willing Shall convert who can prove worthy in the eyes of St. Cuthbert. All right, so I got Mitchell to agree, so let's see. That is well. It is too bad members of the old faith cannot accept a person's freedom to choose. Erleter <laughs> is a good man who will serve us well. Yeah. And Mitch shows his wisdom in letting Erleter follow his heart. Okay, well, he's a hypocrite. But anyways, uh, all right, that's fine. Uh, I think, okay, so I think that's that. I gave him two, so now... I forget who the one wants to convert to the old faith. I'll have to find that one. Sure. And then he's going to have to agree to it. But let's, I don't know if I already got that one running, so let's go ahead. But we got the grain done. I don't know if I can go tell him that too, so let me just see, just for purposes of... RPG, Welcome back to the Church see. of St. Cuthbert. How can I be of service, miss? Remember, St. Cuthbert rewards those who give freely to the needy. Yeah, it doesn't... It do, you know, I was a little disappointed that I, you know... That it doesn't say anything. St. Cuthbert of the Cudgel is the... How can I be of service, yeah. miss? Yeah, okay, well, Remember, no dialogue. Okay. St. Cuthbert rewards those who give freely to the needy. Yeah, okay, but... All right, well... I'm on. I guess if I got the quest done, who cares it, if, you know, like, because he was supposed to give grain to her downstairs, and he didn't, so I did it for him, but, you know, we already got credit for it, so I guess, oh well, a little disappointed there wasn't any dialogue saying, hey, guess what, I, I got that resolved, and, yeah, whatever, okay. So let me see, what else can I work on? Masterwork items, that's going to be when I get the head um, from the, from the uh, giant. So in the vanilla game, that, that's not a part of it because that's not, it's all new content from the Circle of Eight. So um, you just kill that, when you kill that giant, you know, you just get whatever's over there. But in the Circle of Eight, um, you get the quests from... Yeah, the Smith right here. You have to, I have to bring him the head of the giant. So that's what's nice about the new content. Um, but, you know, again, there's a lot of really tough stuff in this game with the new content. But, I mean, this game was always kind of tough. And, um, oh, yeah, and Eddie. And I can show you Eddie. Like, we can do that. And then Cupid's arrow, one of... Oh, yeah, yeah, so I think this clears that up. Not clears it up, but yeah, that... Okay, so that's one portion right there. So let's go... Let me see if I can get that, that worked on or done. All right, let's go right over here. Because I can get a couple of things done in here, I think. Or I can at least the get some progress in them. Alright, so let's take her and find Althea. Okay, now wait a minute now. Am I on the wrong quest? Let me see. Okay, wait a minute. Like I I thought the Miller him at the miller was for this one, but maybe I'm wrong. Okay, so what about my father? Has been assessed work since passing of the mother. I've been noticing fallen to love with. Oh, okay, wait a minute. And he hasn't ever noticed I have. Yeah, wasn't. No, no. Um, okay, so this this is somebody else, Marek. The carpenter. Okay, so I gotta go to the carpenter. So, so I'm wrong on the. I'm mixing up two quests. Why let the old man... Oh, that's too bad. Should try to find... Tug. 
Hmm. Well, let's try that. So it's not that simple, Mark. Oh, okay, all right, yes. Okay, so yeah, this is the one where, all right, so okay, that's fine. I just mixed up the two, so, all right. All right, good, all right, so I know how to do that. I just have to go to a different place now. Okay, so now I can take my character. Now again, as I mentioned in my earlier video about this, Melanie is a druid, and I I made my, my six, and then I get Elmo um, for seven, and then you know I killed off that uh, other lady. So I have this open. Um, but uh, I always try to work on on her she's the worst one in the whole game i think and uh but i tr but she's a druid and i you know what i mean like i i don't mind I, i'd like to have a druid too but then again i'd only have one spot for him and and i need i want at least two spots so so if i can get her to join uh eventually but i gotta i gotta get these two taken care of before i can get her so it's a lot of work to get her, and she's really useless in some ways. But but she can do some magic, so I usually... Uh, well, instead of just yakking about this, let me go ahead and figure this out for a minute. Let me go ahead and talk to her. Hello again. Good to see you again, Ellie. How's it going? I'm doing quite well, thank you. I wish the local merchants would bring in more books, though. I just love to read about adventures. Okay, well, I'll return with some adventure. But first, have you had any adventure? Okay, yes. Yeah, so, okay, let's do that. Sometimes I like to sneak away to the Deklo Grove. But Father thinks it's not safe there. Uh, what is that? Oh, it's a bit north of here. I'll show you on your map. Yeah, but I've already been there and I already cleared it out. But anyways, um, I would like to visit the Deklo Grove. Oh, yeah, no, that's silly. Why does your father think it's not safe? Yeah, let's just do that. Daddy says that the ochre jellies like to ambush people on their way to the grove. He says they're really scary, but I'm not afraid of any ochre jelly. Now, of course, I don't know in the Temple Plus and along with the Circle of Eight mod, if I travel there, will those jellies come out or... Because I've already cleared that from the spiders because you need to get that ring for Black Jay, but... Um, so I don't want to just travel there anyway, but that's good, Melanie. Farewell. Uh, I would gladly protect a beautiful... Yeah, yeah, okay. This is the one where you're flirting with her, so... My hero! <laughs> I'm really enjoying talking to you. You're not at all like the other boys around here. They're all so... boring. Okay, well, perhaps I shall call on you again, my lady. See that you do. Yes, ma'am. All right, so we got that progress slightly. I don't think, let me just take her and go here and see what he, let's see what he thinks now. Now, no, nope, nope, okay, so, all right, so that hasn't progressed. Okay. All right, so at least I know uh, I have to go to where is it? Right here. And we'll have to see what dialogue we get in order to try to work that out. But like I said, that's why I made the rogue. Um, she can, she gets a lot of points, especially if you give her high intelligence, and um, you can, you know, do a lot of dialogue with her alone. Where you need to intimidate, you use these guys here. Uh, diplomacy, I think, is for her, but everything else is for her. So we're gonna go in and Done. see what we get here. What options we get. Alright. Let me go to him. Not getting the dialogue. Okay, so. Hmm. Well, let me see. Okay, here, there, there he is. 
hard to see them sometimes. Alright. Alright, now, okay, now we got some choices here. Let's see. Okay, what, are, what is it I can help you with? Let's see. You and your family seem to be outsiders here. It does not bother you. All this walking around is me. No, that, that's not. That's an insult. Can you make it up? No. I better back. Okay, no. So, yeah, so we got to play this one right here. All right, now he stops working and looks at you. It just doesn't make any sense. We work harder than any folk in town. The that stonemason over there, he's got him good, and he doesn't do half the work. It's so small, it's tough to read this. But anyways, uh, that 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 doesn't sound fair. Rufus and Burn are already on the town council, and they've not been here much longer than us. I just don't understand it. Hmm. There must be something you can do. Okay, well, hmm, let me see. Okay, now, wait a minute. I might have got a something. Okay, I think it's that Jarrow fella spreading lies about us new St. Corporate folk. We may say he likes balance, but I think he'd just as soon see us leave town now. Perhaps if we converted... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yes, go on. Then I could be with my beloved Althea. Okay, yeah, so this is, yeah, Althea, okay. So why don't you two just convert them? Uh, yeah, well, hmm, no. I already know her, so no answer. All right, let me see, let me see. Okay, well, it's not that simple, I'm afraid. Turgeon and Jaro have been arguing about converts here in Hamlet. For some time, it seems Turgeon wants more followers for St. Cuthbert. Wow, uh, Jaro just wants to keep the balance. So Jaro won't perform conversions? Sure, I'll talk to... Oh, well, let me just see what he says. Yeah, uh, people, if they bring up conversion, I think he's got some arguments with Turgeon, but as outsiders, perhaps you should speak to Jaro about... Yeah, yeah, I will. Okay, so sure, I'll talk to Jaro about getting the conversion. I'll make sure he converts you to old faith. No thanks, I don't want... Yeah, yeah, okay. Alright, so good, good. We got some... Alright, perhaps, I it now, okay, go for now. Alright, good, so I think... If you insist. Alright, so I think that worked. Um, now we just gotta go to Jaro. Right here. And then I think Jaro's gonna... If, if this dialogue works, I think Jaro's gonna say, well, you gotta talk to um, the church. And this is where, like I said, the church is a hypocrite because um, they get two for the one. So this is the one that we need, but you got to give give the church two to make it work really good. Right. So um, and so they fight over conversions, but whatever. Let's go ahead and get her. To work. Hello again. All right, I have some. Okay, to prep. Do I do this one? How can I help you, okay. my daughter? Yes, daughter. What is it you would know? Okay, yes. Yeah, so here we go. Can you con conversion to Wolf? Okay. Yes, I could perform such a conversion, but only with the consent of Turgeon from the Church of St. Cuthbert. There must remain a balance, after all. Okay. So, By the okay. God's will. Now, I, you know, I probably, I probably should do a, a save. So let's go ahead and put number twenty here. Hard save. That way, 
that's it. And now let's go to north. Go to the church. Done. And this is, like I said, um, if, th if you think about this before this happens, right? Uh, he's got he's got two conversions uh, that I gave to him, and he gets mad because one of you know his wants to convert to the old. Uh, if you faith insist, or so let's go ahead and see how this works. All right, so again, let's get her for her dialogue. And let's hope this works so I can just get that part of it done. Welcome back to the Church of St. Cuthbert. All right, do you have time? How can I help you? All right, I have questions about conversions. I can perform conversions here in my church, providing a willing <laughs> convert who can prove worthy in the eyes of St. Cuthbert. All right, so, okay, so you can see how uh, we gave him the leather worker and we gave him uh, Mitchell. So now, um, actually, I need to ask converting from Colbert to the carpenter would uh, be converted to old faith. Yeah, it's called old faith. Okay, so right here. Blasphemy! Ah! That cannot be allowed. <laughs> yeah, see, he gets all irritated over that. Like, think about it. He got two, and he doesn't want to give up one. You know what I mean? Oh my goodness. Now, if I didn't have this extra dialogue here, um, but I've managed to get the leather worker, Ether, and the Spencer's entire family converted to St. Cuthbert. So, I mean, I guess he would, like, if I didn't have this extra uh, option, he would do that. But here, I'm going to just um, say that you're, what I already mentioned that before this even happened, and that he's a hypocrite. So, I mean... Uh, but I think this will work, so let, but I already saved, so I can always go back to this. And this is a dialogue that you would get, because if you did all this, you'd get that dialogue without having the extra special stuff. So, But yeah, let me just blast him for a minute, because he blasted me. So. Now, I don't know if that's a bug. Let me Welcome see. back to the church. How can I help you? I can perform conversions here in my church, providing a willing convert who can prove worthy in the eyes of St. Cuthbert. Blasphemy! That yeah, cannot see, be allowed. So when I click this, maybe I accidentally clicked that. Let me see. This is the option I want to go, go to him. Oh, all right. Yeah, there we I go. I suppose it will be all right for Merrick to join Jeru yes. in the old faith. Okay. I fear it will not be in his best interest in the long term to stray from St. Cuthbert, but love can do funny things to a man. Yes, indeed, love does do funny things to men. But anyways, okay, so... All right, yeah, I must have accidentally uh, um, clicked this, and that's why I, w I was bumped out of the dialogue. Um, I had to click the best option. I mean, like I said, uh, with, when playing on Windows 10 and with the tempo thing, you can you can play at the resolution that your computer is, and that's what I'm playing on, on the HD computer. And but this is really small, um, and it's a little tough to read. But okay, so you can see two for one, and he gets a little pissed off at it. But you know we got it. So I mean I think we already got credit for it. Let's see. No, we did, they still haven't given us credit yet. Maybe I have to do some more dialogue. Okay, let's go ahead and get out of here. Yes, sir. Like I said, I'm just trying to... Like, I, I know I got to go to the Meadows place and fight the thing, and I, and I could do it maybe in we'll this do. video or the next video. We'll, we'll see. I mean, this RPG thing is kind of like a very long game, so I mean... And people don't like this town, so I know it's kind of boring. But uh, let me see. What, okay, so I think I have to go back to Jaro. So let's go ahead. I think it's Jaro. Yeah, that's who I have to go to. Let's go ahead and go to here. And now we go to Jaro because we gotta let Jaro know that Turgeon approved it, and then he will approve it. 
and then I can go back to over there and tell them and then I can go to here and I can get her married off and that's one part of the thing and then I should go do um, Eddie too so just to, like I said I you know I like showing people right away these little quests all right so anyways let's go to her and talk to him hello again ah I finally done it Jaro Turgeon agreed then perhaps he has seen the wisdom in balance yes I shall make the arrangements with Marek as soon as possible excellent now I might have already got credit Yeah, see, they already gave me the credit for it. Alright. So maybe, um... As you wish! Maybe me going here will be a waste of time. But it's right here, so let's just go ahead and I'll see if we get any uh, dialogue of telling him. Let's see what, what, um... The one we're hoping, Merrick or whatever his name is. Let's see if he. Okay. Like we already got credit for the quest, so I mean, I think this is just aftermath. Let me go to him. All right, so that's old dialogue. I guess you've heard the good news. Jaro has agreed to perform the conversion. I. You are truly an angel. Thank you. Already we can sense that the townspeople are receiving us better. And Althea and I begun our plan in our wedding. Enjoy it. Excellent. Now, I don't know if we get any more dialogue with him. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now that I did that, maybe I can do this. So, well, um, really needs a barn. Can you... Okay, yeah, I suppose I can move that to the top of the priority now. I mean, now, it's all sort of family business as long as you are sure the widow is really going to pay. I'll go check with her. Okay, hey, so let me see if I can knock out two I'm birds on. with one stone. Okay, so let's go back to... Well, uh, one more. I think I can just go to here. That puts me here, so now I can go down here. I can go to her and see if I can... Um... Now, I don't know if I'll get the dialogue. I might. Or do I have to go back in here? But we're going to find out right now. Go in here. Yes. Light catcher, let's go ahead and talk to the lady. Alright, I ask you a few questions. Okay, alright, good. Yeah, they gave me the dialogue, so I got Rick to move up to the bond priority. That is, as long as you are really interested in Filkin and willing to pay the bond. Alright, uh, yes, I am quite fond of him, and he's just been too busy feuding with Percy, but too involved with his work to notice me now. I'll have to talk to the carpenter about payment for that. Oh yeah, well that's great. Uh, no problem. I think I'll go have a chat with him. Okay, so yeah, all right, so. As you wish. Okay, so by clearing up the, um, clearing up the quests, um, from here once you do that and you have good the right dialogue with the right type of character you can get him to agree to that because you already satisfied all the stuff within here and then you know go over to here and clear that up get her to pay for it now we've got to make sure we 
probably gonna I'm probably gonna do a quick save. I mean, I'm not a quick. I mean, I think it's called a quick save. F12. Let's do it. Save right there. So that way, because all that worked pretty good, and so that's all good. Now I just gotta go into here. Will do. And let's tell her, just for the heck of it, we'll solve this one right here. Um, I'm sure you and uh, Merrick will be very happy together. Uh, thank you for all your help. Um, we are so happy. Great. Okay, now... I don't know, like, I, I, didn't, I didn't save any, I mean, I didn't burn any days, so I don't think I'll get any more dialogue with uh, Melanie, so I'll, let's go, but he's going to then tell me, let me, all right, well, I don't know if I should, let me try, let's see if he gets mad about this, okay, now, I don't have time to deal with a new bond or doing the good deeds for my brother, my business is and it's too important. New bond is noble act. Okay, well at least he's not mad at me now. So, um, how about romance would? Okay, let me see. Uh, blushing. Okay, so he blushed. She's a wonderful lady, but it would be f fair to tell she my late. Oh, okay. Uh, not yet. It wouldn't, uh, not by the old faith. Okay, so then we gotta check for Jao. Alright. Uh, ain't nothing gonna bring her back. Now please leave me be. I'll be leaving. Okay, alright. So, I don't know, I don't know if I should burn a day or two to get, let's see if I can, if I can get a uh, Melanie. Because I already, okay, so she's going to be married off, and he needs these two married off, and then Matilda and him, I think, and it, yeah, and so we can then uh, complete this. And I think this is, was in my other video, I thought when I married the other lady with the barbarian, um, I got a sword from him. But it, I think this guy gives us a holy sword when we marry Melanie. And that's something I can give to my cleric at this very, you know, like, so before I go fight the giant, maybe I can get that done. So let me, let me get my character right here and see if I can get Melanie. Hello again. Melanie, I, I could not wait to see you again, please. You, oh yeah, okay, right here. So I will get the dialogue. Oh, that sounds like so much fun. Yes, I will come with you. Oh, wait. Father would never allow it. I cannot disobey him. Hmm. Okay, uh... What would it take for you to join me? Well, I know it's a bit sudden. But, if you were to ask for my hand in marriage, Father would have to let me go. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. Drop to one knee. Melody! Uh, will you marry me? Yes, I will marry you. Excellent. But first you must go ask Father for permission. Once he's given his blessing, then we shall marry. And I can join you on your adventure. Okay. It'll, okay, it'll be great. You know, okay, so, so let me do that. Oh, that would be wonderful. I All right, love so, you. Okay, so, oh boy. Okay, so we have just met, and yet I feel I have known you for a lifetime. I'll go tell you, Father, I love you too. I'll tell you. Um, let me go see Okay. Hmm. Alright, let's do that. Okay. So, alright. Um. Alright, well, again, I think I gotta... Did I... I can't even remember. Did I already go to Jaro? Well, like, I gotta go to, go to Jaro. Oh, um, maybe I should ask for her hand, and then he's gonna get angry. Yeah, let me, let me do that. Oh, 
Okay, so now, this is probably not the dialogue to do. Um, you know the saying, if the cherry ripes for the picking, that's not good. And then the parchment benefactor of such a... See, they're not given... See, yeah, don't do this because... Uh, this ain't gonna work because, like I said, e both of these are an insult, in my opinion. And there should be a third option to just say, to just get out of this, but... I, you know what I mean, so this wasn't the way to go, but, uh, yeah, what the hell are you said, it ain't working, I'll get lost, yeah, see, uh, that's not gonna work, okay, so, that's fine, we can go By the God's will. so yeah, I mean, I don't like the fact that they give us two negative, um, dialogues there, um, because, you know, the, both, of, to me, both of those are insults, and, and why would you, uh, insult when you want to marry somebody and I mean like I said I'm only doing this because she's a druid and I I don't have a druid in my group and she's the crappiest one in the game I think but I work on her a little bit and then I'll just drop her off in town and then I'll have that space open again to do other quests and stuff but but I, I just want her for right one, one purpose and, and I'm gonna I'm gonna have to try to level her up and I'm gonna, and by doing that, I can show you how. Uh, okay, so now this could be bugging out on me. So we're gonna experience. Oh, I, I thought we we're gonna experience a bug or something. But anyways, okay. And that's why you, you should save a lot, anyways. But let's go to general. Hello again. All right. Um, let me see. I think I don't know if it's here or here. Let's see. How can I help you, my daughter? Yes, it's not giving me the dialogue. Yes, daughter. Okay, right here. What is Perfect. it you would know? Within the old faith, would one year, one full year, be enough to properly mourn the loss of a spouse? Yes. The old faith requires one year of mourning for a lost spouse, but after that time, it is permissible, if not encouraged, to court again. All right. I think. I think that should progress. By the God's will. That should progress though. Okay. Now again, I don't know if I should uh, do anything with Percy, but um, because you know they're brothers and they're fighting, but um, I'm thinking that should clear things up. So yes, let's sir. do this. Alright, um let me use her as as the dialogue. Alright, let me see. Where is he? Alright. Okay, she's wonderful, but it wouldn't be... F See, now, why... Like I said, I got the dialogue. Okay, yeah, right here. It's giving it to me. Okay, I've talked to Jaro. Um, he says one year... Yeah, okay. All right, so maybe you're right. It's been long enough. May my dear beloved Talisha rest in peace. She'll always be a part of you, Falcon, but she didn't want you to be happy now. Go invite for dinner. Um, she says she can arrange to get a new bond back to that. Should clear things up between Yeah, okay, so that's the spirit. Good luck. So then if that is done, then shouldn't I be able to now marry her? Let's see. All right, let me see. But I've spoken with Merrick. He converted to the old faith now, so that Athea can marry him. Um, well, uh, 
That would make Melanie next in line, but I have to tell you, she's really special to me. So I think that's why he gives us a holy sword. I mean, I really think that that's what happens. I remember getting a holy sword in this game from one of them. So let's see here. Uh, she's not running off with a first good looking stranger she meets. I can tell you that. Okay, that's fine. You know the same, no, that's wrong. That's wrong. Okay, so first Althea, Merrick, then Matilda. How about our triple? Yeah, okay, so this is the dialogue right here. Okay, so now I suppose I can get, I can't get in the way of true love now, can I? I suppose if she's really in love and you really love her, frowns, he frowns, oh well, and, and you promise to treat her right, of course, you know, I'd allow her to marry you first, Althea, and now Melanie sniffs how soon they grow up. Yeah, well, that, that, that's true. I promise you'll be treated all that. Uh, Melanie is the love of my life. And, uh, uh, okay. Okay, so then I think I just gotta... Here I am. I just gotta go over to her. Let's see. That's Althea. All right. Everybody get out of the way for me. There she is. Hooray! Daddy agreed to let us marry. I'm so glad to be with you now. I'm ready for great adventures with you, love. Oh, okay, yeah, that's great. Let's continue on with our grand adventure. All right, so we just cleared all this up, I think. Um, I don't know if there's any more dialogue with him. Let's take a look for just a minute. Okay, uh, we are doing well, thanks, but I can't but notice some of my wealth has been sneaking away. Okay, alright, so now this, this starts another quest, okay, um, tell me more. Okay, so we just got another quest. I'll go check around and see if I can find anything. Okay, so, yeah, there's one more quest with him. And that's about stealing farmers or something. Yes, sir. So we just we just act. Ah, uh, home sweet home. Okay, so now we can take a look at her and see that she's got a little bit of money. <laughs> she's got no. Uh, she doesn't even have a weapon. She's got this uh, gray farm garb, and I can tell you, she only could hold. 25 pounds that's it she 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 has crappy sets and stuff like that but it's a quest to do and it's a lot of work to get a you know a junky npc but again i don't have a druid at the very moment and we're all we're full now and uh okay so I'll go over here for just a minute, and we will, uh, let's see. Whatever you say. All right, so let me see what I can, I don't have anything in here. I should have put some stuff in here, but this great, you can't, I, I don't even think you can sell it, so I'm just going to drop it in here. I mean, I could drop it out there. But, um, I can drop it here and it'll stay right here, but I mean, this way if it's in a, in a chest, it might be better for the game. Um, I'll take a little bit of money, and what I can do is, let me see, if I, um, go to one of my characters, and then I can bring the money into here. Okay, so, yeah, I don't think she she is like really bad um, but like I said I, I added her so what we well, what we can do is trying to think 
didn't I... I wonder if I should go to the mold house. Let me take a moment. Um, I mean, I, I, I should do a quick save. Let me do that. Uh, because I did do a lot of the um, quests, so... Let me go to the moat house just for a quick moment. Look at this place. I've never been here before. Like, I think I cleared it out, but um, what about the... See, Will I'm, do. I'm looking for the... Go Will do. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, so I still have stuff in here. And... Oh, yeah, and I even have... Alright, so, yeah, let me... Like, I can't give her, like... Let me see what, um... Uh... Oh, yeah, here, here's what I can give her. Okay. Because this is what I took off of... I think it was, her name was Frilla when I killed her off. Because that's the only way you can get her out of your group. But I can give her this. Because she can do this. So at least she can be able to use this this here. Um, and I can give her a cloth shirt. Oh, I can give her gloves just for the heck of it. Because, watch if I do this. Oh, okay, so she's at 19, so then... Why don't I go ahead and let her have this, then? Instead of the cloth shirt. Right, because that's 15 pounds. This is 20, but... I'm telling you, at 26, I think it's 26. Yeah, 26, so... So if I give her one... Like, she can do this this uh, weapon right here. But that might be enough to put her over her weight. But at least this allows me to, um, you know, give her some weapon. So she'll be at some use to me. And also, uh, what I should do while I'm here, is we can go and see what she can do. It, uh, yeah, because, all right, perfect. Because this is what I want. I want this, um, this entangle, and what else does she have that I can do? Let's go over here to cure. Cure, yeah. Read magic just for a bit. And I could do two entangles, maybe, or... Oh, cure light wounds. Oops, oops, sorry. Right here. Alright, so if she gets hurt, she can cure herself. Um, so yeah, okay, so that's what I want. I definitely wanted this, because I need to use that on the giant. But again, she she has lousy numbers. Um, I think she has like a nine for strength, and that is a negative. You don't you don't get to see it, but um, you have to do a lot of work to try to get her up. But anyways, we'll rest for eight hours. I'm not hurt, so. Whoops. And now she'll have those. Oh, Alright, so she's active. Okay. Okay, so then uh, what I can do is go to her and get over here. Yes. I'm 
I'm exhausted. Yeah, Let's I, rest a while. I know, but you know, while I'm here, I may as well now. My pack is full. Yeah, I, I'm sorry, I know, okay. I'm Just, carrying too much. Yeah, I know. Good. Alright, now that we got that. Okay. Alright, this was just to come over here to get those stones and that, that um, for um, Melanie. Because um, I gotta give her some kind of weapon so that way she can defend herself. And then we're gonna go back to um, her. And we're gonna go over here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get... Cause she has higher praise, so we're gonna go over here. All right, so let's go ahead and sell off some of this stuff. It's only gonna take a moment um, for me to do this, um, and like I said, and for anybody who's watching who doesn't. That doesn't mind, and this is fine. I just or want to do a lot of this, usually off camera, because, um, you know, this, this is like really a slow process. I wish we could just tag a lot of this stuff and just send it over, but... Now this I'll keep, because we can throw that, I guess. This just gives us some money so that way we can um, buy stuff. Almost done. I think I still have uh, one other character that has stuff. As a matter of fact, while I'm doing this, I have to check to see if I got the holy sword. Um, did did what's his name give it to us? I don't think so. Oh yeah, right here. Radiant sword. Okay, let's go ahead and identify that. Okay, yeah, so um, you can see here it's a plus one holy sword. And yeah, it won't let me do the shift to look at it because I'm still buying stuff or identifying, I think. Well, let me see if I can do that. Yeah, so plus one enhancement and holy, so it, it does, um, and that's what I want for my cleric. Okay. So yeah, so once you marry Melanie and you do all that, because it's a lot of work to do that quest. Um, he's, the, he's the one that gives you that sword, because he, he really cherishes Melanie. So. <laughs> so, so that is one benefit that you get out of it. And if you did all this instead of going to the moat house and stuff you would have this sword that you could be using so anyways let me get back to um, this guy here now the great axe you know i even thought about that i don't know if anybody has an opinion but uh for my ranger or for my see i think falcon i gave him the I gave him the focus on the great sword because in this game you can get a great sword later on that does cold damage and that's where that's why I want him to have this so he can end up with that sword uh, later on 
Um, but anyways, I should be doing this while I'm talking. But, but yeah, so I was wondering if anybody knows, you know, like, do you like this one? A, a 1D12 20 times 3. Like, for example, compared to the, the glob. You know, which is 1D10 instead of 1D12. But, but I, I always pick this one. But um, I'm just wondering, do you think the great axe is better? So, I mean, if you're, if you're a player and you know that and you, you're watching me at this very moment, you can hear what I'm saying. If you can answer that, that would be kind of cool to know. But anyways, let's continue on. And I'm just going to get rid of it. Because at the moment, like I said, I already have the focus on the um, the glob, so it's, I don't want to burn a skill on, you know, another weapon. Like, I, I'd rather just go with one weapon focused. And I think we can sell those. All right, I think... We're all good. Oh, okay. Yo, no, I don't want to do that. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. Well, maybe can I give this sword to her? Yeah, I can. All right. So she's got just a regular sword. So if I give her this one. Now, this just bumped up to eight instead of seven. So and that means I can get rid of this. There. So now she's got the holy sword. And that's what I wanted, so that's do you know, so that's good. So let's see if we're we're good to go. Look at all the characters just quickly. Oh yeah, and I can get rid of this shirt because Melanie can have that armor. That'll help her. But, you know, like I said, she can't go past twenty six, but the only other thing I could give her is um, the Schmeider, I guess. Like I could probably even buy it here. But let me see. Let's see what he's got. It's got f weight of four. So let's see. Yep, now she's at 20. So, um, she's already pretty much maxed out. Like, if I give her one, um, cloak, I think the cloaks weigh five pounds. That'll put her at 25, and, and, and that's about the max that she can have, so. At least she has a weapon, and let's see if I give her a weapon that she's focused on. It's a negative one. You see that? A negative one. That's because she only has, I think, nine for strength. So, yeah. So, this was... I mean, it's. I got a lot of money, so... She she gets a negative one so on, on a weapon that she is actually... Oh, she's just proficient on it. She's not focused on it, so... So, if you focus her on it, then she'll get a plus one... But, yeah, uh, she she totally sucks. But, anyways, okay. So, I think um, what I can do is uh, get my group. Where are they? All right, I can go, go ahead and do a hard save. Let's go to 21. And I, and I think I'm going to end the video right here. Um, and then I'll come back and, 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 and we'll tackle Emity, Emity Meadows, which we have to get, we have to kill that giant. So that'll be in the next video. So anyways, no matter where you are in the world, I hope you're doing really good. 
I hope that you are good during the day, night, or even in your evening. Um, take care of yourself. Be kind to each other. God bless to you and your own religion. This is your friend Jeff signing out. Adios, amigos and amigas.